Okay, it's our first trip to the beach. So I thought I would show you guys what I'm packing for four people, two adults and two kids. So we have this bag that has a bunch of sand pails and sand toys and letters for Phoenix to dig and bury and all that. A blanket type thing, like one of those picnic ones, and a tent. So I have that all in this bag so it's easier to carry. Then this is our beach bag. I have, um, what are these, sunscreens, my little clip. In here I have sunglasses for the kids, uh, tissues that was in there, and nothing in here, but that's where we'll put like whatever. Then I have towels, change of clothes, um, deodorant, uh, cologne and perfume, a hairbrush, everything we need to kind of change back to regular clothes. I also have a wet bag um, to put in the wet clothes. So that is all in here for all of us. Then in here I have just regular diaper bag stuff that I kind of always have. This pouch has some snacks. I have a portable charger, a, some extra wipes, an extra change of clothes. That's just kind of what's always in the bag, so I left it in there. Then in here I have 10 diapers, five for each kid. I have two snack cups like this. I have this full with food for Phoenix and another one on the bottom, kind of food that doesn't need to be refrigerated. I got a full pack, brand new pack of wipes. I have my case for my, um, my phone to get wet. And I have the devices for the ride home. And that's it. This is kind of empty, but we'll throw in, like, John will probably throw in his wallet and his keys and all that type of stuff once we get there. So that's done for that. And then we have the last thing. Last, we have this packet picnic size freezer bags. And I have some waters in there, the kids' waters, and then the kids' milk. Because we're, we're going to want this. <laughs> the kids and milk then some snacks yogurt applesauce cheese sticks just stuff like that this is my handy dandy list and then i have two sandwiches in here for the kids as well and that's everything that i'm taking for a few hours at the beach our first trip to the beach so i probably have more than enough things but i feel like i'd rather be overpacked than underpacked and this is a great bag i won it in a giveaway you just freeze the whole bag overnight there's um what are these uh freezer bags ice packs built in that are frozen and i put it in last night so it's not as frozen as it probably could be but it's supposed to last a good amount of time so now i have to fit all this in there